Welcome to 2022. New Year's resolutions, well, I don't do those, but um, playing the ukulele every day would be certainly high on a list if I had a list. So let's do some fun with some scales. This is a scale of D major, not using any open strings and trying to do it with this IM pattern the right hand and the left hand is going to be doing some different slides to get to new positions. So here's the basic one. And if they all sounded the same, well they really should, because all you're doing is moving and shifting a different finger. So sometimes I shifted finger one, sometimes it was two, sometimes it was three, and sometimes it was four. Now D has always presented nice problems for playing. The chord of D, well I put down ten here, including one revolting one. But here are some basic ones, and the whole idea of this little exercise is to be able to play them, but also play not just a strum, like the first one I'm doing with a bar 2, 2, 2, 0. And that's the D I'm using, just the basic D chord shape. Nothing fancy like a fuller D with the little finger on the higher D, but just with the repeating the two A's. So, the idea is, when you've done it, you can also do this. So you can actually hear that you are playing all of the strings effectively. So. Now a second finger bar. Now some variations on this. Now on to a third finger bar. fourth finger bar. Notice that's quite tricky. Often that is better when it's moved up and you've got the first finger coming down to accentuate this bend in the joint on the fourth finger. And now one which I don't disapprove of but I need special reasons for doing it. I had a guy who had really hurt his hand doing a lot of um, working with pneumatic drills and he found some of these other ones quite difficult but with that he could get it to work. But as I say ow because it really does hurt. Um, so that's just a bit of fun at the new year and I'll be doing these occasional um, sessions just showing some of the things, some of the variations that you can look at. When I first did the D chord one, um, I got it to something like 60 different ways of playing it if you started introducing really weird ideas and using the thumb. Um, but I think if you can do the first nine, and don't worry about the tenth one, then you'll have some fun. And of course you can get the music from these by, by emailing me and I will send you uh, the first of this new free series for 2022. Thank you for watching.